Hello, in this JavaScript video, I am going to show you the You thought I'd stop talking, I'm just messing with you. Uh, can you guess? I'm sure you know. It's method overriding, it's the title of the video and the lesson. Okay, so method overriding. As you can see, we did inheritance. If you didn't check that video out, highly recommend going and have a look at that. And okay, so we have these two classes that inherit from here. That have a, it has a constructor, but it also has this function called vehicle func. And at the next task, I asked you to call the vehicle func of the car object and the bike object as well. The bike object we did, but the car object as well. Okay, so now that's done, what we're going to do is override the method in class. And to override it, all we do is literally take the exact same structure but we do something else with the method so we're going to say console.log we are going to say this is the car class so if i save that refresh as you can see when we call it from the car object and it'll be the same with the car object too because that's you know a object of the car class when we call it from the car object say this is the car class Whereas when we call it from the bike object, it says this function is from the vehicles class. So we've overridden the method and all it all that is, is we are specifying a new structure, new piece of code to be run instead. So maybe you have this vehicle class and you have maybe a method for moving and you have a car, you have a bike, you have what other sort of vehicles can you have? You have a plane, though, you have a vehicle as well. You have a boat, those four vehicles, and maybe the boat has a slightly different functionality compared to the car, the bike, and the plane for moving. And we could override the method without having to, you know, write a new separate method therefore creating redundant code for the other three classes that have the exact same functionality so that's method overriding if you have any questions feel free to pop me a message and as usual i look forward to seeing you in the next video